Test 2 Part 1 Look at Part 1 Now we are ready to start. For each question, choose the correct answer. 1. How did the man get to work? It's 9.30. You're late, John. Did you miss the train again this morning? I decided to drive for a change because the weather is so bad. When I got to the main road, a taxi had crashed into a school bus and blocked the whole road. All the school kids were standing in the rain waiting for the school to send another school bus. Anyway, the police closed the road and sent all the traffic on a different route that was longer and took me an extra 20 minutes. Now listen again. It's 9.30. You're late, John. Did you miss the train again this morning? I decided to drive for a change because the weather is so bad. When I got to the main road, a taxi had crashed into a school bus and blocked the whole road. All the school kids were standing in the rain waiting for the school to send another school bus. Anyway, the police closed the road and sent all the traffic on a different route that was longer and took me an extra 20 minutes. Two. What will the girl buy? Good afternoon. Do you have any fresh strawberries today? I'm very sorry. We have sold up this morning. We had some big juicy ones. I'll have some more tomorrow morning. I've got some lovely raspberries fresh from the farm today, if you like, and some very sweet cherries. I'm not sure my parents are keen on raspberries. They are too sour. So I'll take some apples, bananas and some of those cherries, please. No, wait a minute. My dad told me to get pears, not apples. Now listen again. Good afternoon. Do you have any fresh strawberries today? I'm very sorry. We have sold up this morning. We had some big juicy ones. I'll have some more tomorrow morning. I've got some lovely raspberries fresh from the farm today, if you like, and some very sweet cherries. I'm not sure my parents are keen on raspberries. They are too sour. So I'll take some apples, bananas and some of those cherries, please. No, wait a minute. My dad told me to get pears, not apples. Three. What will the weather be like tomorrow night? Now, kids, I have an announcement. Tonight, as the sun goes down, the temperature will drop a lot and there will be some strong winds. Tomorrow's forecast is not much better. We expect a very foggy morning, which will slowly clear as the sun comes up. But still, during the day it will be cold, with strong winds. This will change again tomorrow night, as we expect heavy rain. If this is the case, we might not be able to go on our scheduled school trip, as we are supposed to be outdoors. Now listen again. Now kids, I have an announcement. Tonight, as the sun goes down, the temperature will drop a lot and there will be some strong winds. Tomorrow's forecast is not much better. We expect a very foggy morning, which will slowly clear as the sun comes up. But still, during the day it will be cold, with strong winds. This will change again tomorrow night, as we expect heavy rain. If this is the case, we might not be able to go on our scheduled school trip, as we are supposed to be outdoors. Four. What will Ben do on Saturday afternoon? Hi Ben, do you want to go ice skating Saturday morning? I'd love to, but I promised my mum I'd help her cut the grass and pick up the leaves. Well, how about in the evening? I'm going to the cinema to see the new horror film of Tracy from school. I could go with you after lunch, though. The film doesn't start till 7pm, so I'll have plenty of time. That's great. See you at about 2 o'clock. Now listen again. 
Hi, Ben. Do you want to go ice skating Saturday morning? I'd love to, but I promised my mum I'd help her cut the grass and pick up the leaves. Well, how about in the evening? I'm going to the cinema to see the new horror film of Tracy from school. I could go with you after lunch, though. The film doesn't start till 7pm, so I'll have plenty of time. That's great. See you at about two o'clock. Five. What did Alison do? Hi, Alison. You look terrible. What did you do to yourself? Walk into a door? Very funny. Yesterday morning, I was walking the dog when it suddenly saw a cat and ran right in front of me. So you tripped over your dog? No, I managed to stop that from happening by stepping to the side, but I didn't see a hole in the field and I fell into it. It was very painful and it took over an hour for my parents to come and get me. Now listen again. Hi, Alison. You look terrible. What did you do to yourself? Walk into a door? Very funny. Yesterday morning, I was walking the dog when it suddenly saw a cat and ran right in front of me. So you tripped over your dog? No, I managed to stop that from happening by stepping to the side, but I didn't see a hole in the field and I fell into it. It was very painful and it took over an hour for my parents to come and get me. Six. What animal will they buy? Do you think Grandma would like a parrot? I think it would be perfect as it's easy to look after and cheap to feed. She really needs something that will be more of a friend for her. Something that will sit on her lap while she watches TV. How about a dog? That would be good. Or maybe a cat. I think she prefers dogs. But she likes cats too, and they don't need to be taken for a walk every day. Hmm. And in the winter, she can't go out so often. So that's decided then. Now listen again. Do you think Grandma would like a parrot? I think it would be perfect as it's easy to look after and cheap to feed. She really needs something that will be more of a friend for her. Something that will sit on her lap while she watches TV. How about a dog? That would be good. Or maybe a cat. I think she prefers dogs. But she likes cats too, and they don't need to be taken for a walk every day. Hmm. And in the winter, she can't go out so often. So that's decided then. Seven. What time will Sue collect the children? Hi Dawn, it's Sue, John's mother. I'm just phoning about collecting the kids at quarter to four. The plans have changed a bit. My dental appointment for three o'clock has been changed. It's at five, so I may as well pick up the kids first and they can come with me. So I'll be half an hour earlier than we'd planned. I hope this is okay with you. Please can you send me a text message to confirm that you've received this message. See you later. Now listen again. Hi Dawn, it's Sue, John's mother. I'm just phoning about collecting the kids at quarter to four. The plans have changed a bit. My dental appointment for three o'clock has been changed. It's at five, so I may as well pick up the kids first and they can come with me. So, I'll be half an hour earlier than we'd planned. I hope this is okay with you. Please can you send me a text message to confirm that you've received this message. See you later. That is the end of part one.